Hi guys! The Mad Max. Famous movie, famous bracelets. We've done a quite a few in the past few videos. Now we have the suggestion to do the other Mad Max bracelet to make the Mad Max edition. And here we have the basic Mad Max. Uh, bracelet, parkour bracelet, and we have here the uh, Mad Max fishtail bracelet. Now some of my friends ask me to do the snake Mad Max, like this one, but with the uh, Mad Max bracelet endings. So I decided to do the this one, the Mad Max Snake. As you can see it's universal, it can fit all sizes with this Mad Max edition. And it's a snake knot, as you can see. It's very tight and pretty simple to make it but you need to have the uh, from the beginning the right right stitch so to get on business please if you like this like this video subscribe do a comment and the tutorial for this particular bracelet is coming right now, so stay tuned and see ya! Hi guys! Welcome to the Alpha1982 YouTube channel. My name is Dale and today I'm gonna show you how to make the Mad Max Paracord bracelet but doing it by Cobra or sorry, Snake Knot. For this bracelet we're gonna need the paracord, I'm using this grey one, 550 as usual, uh, total length 8 feet or 2.5 meter, 248 centimeters to be exact. Now the first thing you're gonna do is to take these two ends, find the middle of your paracord, here it is, and then when you've done this, take the left string and make it on top of the right create a small loop on the right side and then when you've done this simply pull this left string through this right loop like so Now tighten it up and be aware that this uh, loop here is gonna be uh, just the right size to pull your two strands of the paracord after that because we're gonna do this bracelet to be adjustable to fit all sizes so we're gonna do also the diamond knot now when we done this take again the left one the left string pull it on top of the right one make the loop but this time you want gonna you wanna <clears throat> make this right loop uh, sorry not loop this right string going under the left one and through the right loop like this and this is the snake knot like so now just tighten it up to cut all slides And here we are, our first knot is done. 
So the difference between the starting when we make the first loop and this one is just when you take this left strand and make it on top of the right, do the loop on the right side. But when you done this, you won't gonna uh, put the left strand back through this loop. No, you're gonna take this right strand under the left one and then through this right loop. If you guys have any questions about this particular loop or bracelet, please do leave the comment down below and I'm gonna answer to all your questions and suggestions you may have. So feel free to leave any kind of the comment, either you like this or you have a better idea or anything, I'd be glad to answer and talk to you and of course if you like this please subscribe give a thumb up now let's see I'm gonna zoom a bit to make you clear take the left strand on top of the right make the loop on the right side like this then this left strand gonna be as is and this right gonna go under the left then over the left like this and through the right loop as you can see and that's it now we are gonna squeeze it cut the slack and make the snake knot simple as that I hope you now have the clear view of this snake knot so I'm gonna unzoom now and continue making the knots so left one on top of the right one then under the right one gonna go under the left one on top and through the right loop it seems to be the difficult knot or stitch but believe me it's simple it's enough you doing once or one stitch and you will good at this so I'm gonna skip forward to the very end of the bracelet so I wanna waste your time and then I'm gonna show you how to make the diamond knot and finishing the bracelet and here guys we are on the end of the bracelet as you can see almost done now just we are left with the time knot but one more time uh, for you to remember so the left strand I'm gonna go on top of the right and make this loop on the right side but the right strand I'm gonna go under the left strand over and through this loop and then you're gonna cut the slack, slack and make it like this as you can see now measure your wrist And this fits perfectly. So we're gonna do stop knot, but first we're gonna use the needle or the feather 
as someone calls it. And we're gonna make it true like this. And again, the last one. Now guys, we just left to do this top knot, we're gonna take the right cord, make it on top, and the left one make it the loop under. <coughs> now this right cord gonna go behind and through the right loop, and this left cord gonna go on top and through this left loop and we are done now just pull it to make it tight cut and it's like it is held and that's it we are done the stop knot is done we all gonna have to do is to cut the excess of the paracord <coughs> and we are done with the bracelet now take the scissors cut off the take the lighter of the brenner And that's it. Now the same with this one. So guys, if you like this tutorial or you like this Mad Max style paracord bracelet in a snake knot, please give a thumb up, like the video, share it with your friends and family, please do subscribe and if you have any questions, suggestions, remarks or anything like that. Please also leave the comment or contact us via Facebook or Google+. Until the next time, stay safe, be well and see you soon. Dale signing out. Bye.